Hello everybody, this is Chris here. Back to play The Long Dark. And, uh, I think we're ready. <coughs> it's kind of cold here tonight, so I guess, I guess that might help the mood. Okay, let me, let me adjust something. Oh, I think we've got a storm and it's quite loud. So what were we going to do? I think the weather was good. Um, we killed two wolves yesterday, and we've got their hides curing on the ground. Um, what were we going to do? We have the rifle. We need to find a way to clean it, repair it. actually don't have a lot of water, I don't think. I, I remember vividly that we had a thing we were going to do. Um, and I can't remember what that thing was. Also, why is this stuck? Um, so we could go back, oh that's, that is all of our water. We could go back to what we were trying to do. Um, but I think because we found the food, maybe we don't shouldn't be in a rush. I found the food because we shot the wolf. I think we should gather some wood, make a fire, make a lot of water. Oh. Well, so much for the for the weather being nice, huh? Let's see how long this is going to take with the hatchet. An hour. Uh, that's probably not a very good Wait, how do I... I've forgotten how to play already. Yeah, negative 30, so not gonna not gonna chop that up. In fact. Our, our temperature's dropping so quickly. We can't really do much of anything. I think we can harvest this. And here's our wolf meat from last night. But that that's, that's just about all we can do. Maybe a bad idea. Okay. So I'm gonna make a fire. Oh, oh, Cook one crazy. of these. Uh, we'll warm up. We'll warm up inside. No big deal. So. I, I, I distinctly remember the weather being super nice and quitting on that note. I wonder if somehow maybe the weather changed because um, I just want to make sure you can see that. Yeah, so I just wanted to see if, I, I was thinking maybe the weather changed just because we saved and quit. That's kind of, it's kind of a shame. 
Um, I know what we can do. We can read today and try to learn some skills. Do that in the... Do that while the light is good. Um, let's put some more stuff away. I think we kind of skimped on that at the end. So we boiled these because <clears throat> we had a fire. Um, they help you sleep. I don't think we need to carry one around. We'll probably bring it if we go on a long um, journey. Same with the coffee, at least today. Or listen to that wind. Um, we, we repaired all our clothes. Carry all of the antibiotics, but uh, all right, we've got a couple of matches. Might want to grab some more matches. And we throw just a few little things in here. I like to have, I like to keep everything off, and that way, um, if we decide to go somewhere, we can hop, hop on out. sure you have to take like two pills when you're sick or something. Uh, okay, it's pretty good. It's pretty good considering we're carrying the rifle. So now that we've got really good light, I think it might be worth taking a, another look around since there's not a whole lot to do today. Uh, we can't go out. We'll make some water, and we'll, maybe we'll break down some furniture, um, and then we'll read. Actually, we'll probably read first, because we can make water at night, but we can't read at night. It's a shame there's no beans left. So all this we can break down actually with the hatchet. Is that covered up? Um, no, it's good. So I'm, I'm just, I don't know exactly how big my cabeza is. Um, things will sometimes spawn in really hard to to find places and it's just it's just worth while to go over uh, make me do a nice check now that we have some good light all right well I don't see anything so let's um, let's try to read that book what would that be under Um, this is a pretty quick one, and this is super useful for us. It'll help us start fires. So let's let's do a do two hours. Maybe the weather's getting good. It sounds pretty nice outside. I don't hear anything. Alright, let's go check. Let's go check the weather. Weather.com. Um, I'm gonna the rest of the meat's outside, I'm just gonna leave that there. And 
I think we can maybe eat the whole thing. Good. So now we don't have any meat on us. In case we want to take a little small walk. Okay. Much better. Much better. So it's not... Um, Hear that, but uh, it's a really annoying animal in real life. Um, okay. Well, visibility is pretty bad. Don't move it. The temperature is really nice. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I don't have, oh yes I do, I have cattails. I'm gonna do what we tried to do last night, which is make our way to this, I think it's called the Trapper's Lodge or something. Um, I'm not exactly sure where it is. And this is where we encountered the, the wolves trying to get there. I think we checked him out. It's sort of a little blemish. The, the corpses never go away, which I guess by itself is fine, but the, the birds never go away either. You'd think they'd have picked it clean by now. Let's, let's get a couple of branches. I, you never know what might happen. After the storm, the branches tend to come back, the little twigs and stuff, uh, which is a nice... There's not a lot of things in this game that respawn. Well, except the animals. The animals, um, I think the wind might be picking up. The animals just go crazy. Is that a second set of birds? Now, I, I don't want to shoot any more wolves. Have to. So we're coming up. This is this is uh, probably our wolf here that uh, one of the two that we shot last night. They're very close to one another, and we picked them clean except for some gut. It's like twenty minutes, but uh, gut is not super important. Um, every animal has gut. Alright, so I think we pretty much looted this little corridor and there was a corpse. I'm going to head down this this way. Now this is um, this is sort of a calculated risk. I don't really know where the lodge is. And the visibility is pretty low, but the but the temperature is good, and I think it's in this general direction. Maybe. Um, it's totally possible that we get lost, and that. I'm unable to find, let's say, the railroad tracks or, or whatever it takes to get my bearings. Um, so the birch trees drop. Could kill a deer.
It's good weather. We're not too far from home. Um, as you get better at shooting, your it stops. It wiggles less. What a great shot! I, if I do say so myself. One shot, one kill. That's how you do it, folks. Um, Alright. Let's... Let's build a fire. Just... Oh, it's too steep to build a fire. Oh my gosh, look at all this meat. 20 pounds. Oh, it's good weather. Oh, we're so we're so lucky. Let's get the hide, and let's go ahead and get the guts. Fifty minutes. How many? All right. So now the question is: Should we go home, or should we um, go to the lodge? I think we should go home. Um, I'm do I, I'm t I don't want to get lost with all this meat, and we're nearly overburdened. So let's um, let's head back for a second uh, sort of a second aborted attempt. But that's that's okay. You know, this this hide and this um, this meat are going to sustain us. So if you shoot and you miss, the deer will run away. Um, it's very hard to hit them. And they're running. Sometimes you can clip them or, or hit them, let's say, in their body, they don't necessarily die. But I, I think I got it on its head. Um, I can't remember how many deer skins it takes to make deer pants, but Definitely check it out when we get back home. Well, not a lot happened, but it's pretty exciting. Pretty exciting day. Killing a, a, a deer gives you a whole lot more meat um, than finding a deer that a wolf's been eating on. As you can imagine, they tend to pick through, leave just the gristle. Keep thinking those little rocks are something. Well, I think I think what we'll do is maybe we'll read a bit until it's um until it's dark. We'll sleep a bit, and then we'll make some some water to take advantage of uh, of the night, and then um, and when we start tomorrow, we can start after it's warmed up a bit. I think we're good. I think we're good. I don't know. Just 
jog a bit here. All right. No wolves. So we smell quite strongly, carrying 20 pounds of raw meat. A welcoming sight for sure. Luckily, animals cannot open doors. All right, let's uh, let's make a new little pile here. Satisfying little plot. Ah, oh, so nice. Well, at least for the moment, we don't have a food problem anymore. Let's put, um, let's put this deer hide down. I'm not sure where our original gut went. Oh, I think that's it. Okay. Try to keep them separated so that you can tell when they're when they're cured. Let's just put the feathers away to keep things tidy. Don't I don't know if we picked up much else except for uh, branches, sticks, sorry. Um, wait, we're going to make a fire, so I'm just going to keep them on my person. Oh, there was also, I wanted to check, I found, oh, yeah, I thought I saw, I saw something, and I didn't think to, to look at the time, but another bullet. So we have 11 shots right now, I think. Um, all right, let's we don't have any cooked meat, do we? <laughs> um, it's okay. All right, so I'm going to read, maybe finish the book. I think I think there's like three more hours, or so maybe maybe not. Let's try it. Actually, if you fail, I think you lose all your progress, which doesn't make any sense. That's not how books work, but. Um, like, if it gets too dark to read. Yeah. So I think you just, I just wasted the time, but. Uh, oops. Sorry about that. We didn't make any progress. So. I'm going to need to rest soon. Uh, then I'm going to get a couple of, let's say, four. Just to kind of give us some pickup. I'll get up and go. And then we'll see if we can't find the stove. This is probably going to be tough. I should have brought the lantern, huh? But there's the window. So we take a left. workbench, I think. Right? So the stove is here. Alright. So let's make some water and some food. I'm trying to decide if I should... Uh, are really easy to start fires with. Um, <laughs> I can't, I, I can't see the snow.
All right. So, yeah, there we go. So 75% is much better. Let's start that. We're in no rush. No need to use accelerant. Um, now, the nice thing about this little process is that it actually does warm up the air if you're, if you're in an emergency situation, even if you fail to, um, to actually start the fire, this gets a little bit warm. Just a little bit, though. Sticks. Well, a couple, you know what I mean. All right. Um, I was really hoping that would light up the place better. Um, we need to get that meat. Good God. Let's um. Uh, let's cook the wolf first. The deer is super fresh. Cook maybe two pieces. Let's do three. Oh, well, I forgot about this piece that's in here. Ah, well, we'll eat it. So, yeah, let's start with, let's start with the cooking. Oh, well, we need water. But we need food, too. And I think we need some water, so... Okay. Can we drink? Eat. Like kings tonight. We've, we've used three bullets, though, so I don't, I don't think that's something to be particularly proud of. But we, we're alive. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and cook all this. Now, there's skills related to tearing, uh, to dressing a, a wolf or a deer. There's skills related to cooking. Um, I think that little symbol means we gain some cooking skill. Um, if you get to cooking five, I wanna say you can't get food poisoning from cooked food, which is pretty cool. Well, Gonna need to put more wood on in order to make water. Um, did not anticipate how long this would take, but let's use some reclaimed wood. It's not it's not very hot, but there's a bunch of it in the area. Maybe I should just put this last piece back outside. I think I will. All right. Um, each of these different woods have different properties to like some increase the temperature, some burn longer. I kind of wish we had a bigger supply of wood so that we could make more water. But um, I think we'll be fine. <sighs> Don't want to put that other book in the in the fire. I've done it before. It's pretty it's pretty terrible feeling to to burn one of the skill books. All right, so this is like. I don't know, two days or so worth of water. All these are 100% because they were so high when we cooked them. And they just get better when you cook. But here, we've already eaten two of them. Um, this person eats like a, like a pig. Drinks like a fish. 
So I'm going to throw another of these on and cook since we went through it so fast. And maybe... No, I, I don't think so. I, I was going to say maybe we could get through this much. I, I think it gives you partial. Yeah. So we can try to do this. I don't think we need the fire. So we'll get a little bit, and some of it will be... Okay, well, that was surprising. I mean, I sort of thought it would glow or something. So we didn't get any from that. I really thought it was a partial thing. That's a shame. All right. Um, so workbench. We want that wall to go around the thing. I'm getting better at this. And the wall go upstairs. I bet these. I bet these windows are here just for this purpose. Okay. And across. I'm not sure what that is. Perfect. Um. Let's try to sleep salt on. Well, we've definitely had goodish luck after our rocky start. Our collection of pelts is growing. Um, let's take a look what it takes to get some clothes. Deer skin pants, three deer hide, four gut. Just getting boots, two. So perhaps we could make boots. But four gut. Wolf skin is four wolves. Um, rabbit skin is four pelts. Maybe we should look for some rabbits and hit them with rocks. Not a big fan of the snares. You gotta be in a really well populated place. Um, uh, in terms of rabbits. All right, so we've got all this meat. Let's put some of it away. Let's, let's definitely get some more matches. I, I can I can see myself failing five times. We just need one. Um, we'll put some of this water. We'll start keeping this on the ground, but for now, I'm just going to put that in there. Okay, what else we got? Gun, axe. Um, I hear the wind outside. Let's take a quick peek. Maybe we'll finish the book off if it's um, if it's too rough. It's moderately cold, so let's see how it is after an hour. And this will give us. Um, there's a couple of benefits you get from skilling up in fire making. Did we not skill up? Well, okay. We didn't skill up, but uh, it gave us like a certain number of experience points. Let's keep these books in a particular place just so that we know we finished them. And then if uh, if we need, we can use them for fuel. This looks like a good place. 
get another book for reading. Put that in tools, yeah. So we've got a shooting book, a fishing book. Let's go for the shooting book. It, I think it takes like 20 hours of reading or something. Okay. So at this point, I really want to find better clothes, more bullets, and a gun cleaning kit. I think those are what I want most. All right, let's um, let's pop these in. Not a whole lot of weight, but okay. So it sounds like it's died down. Um, I think I'm ready to take a third trip to that place. Um, Maybe it's not a good idea to do it with meat, but um, maybe we can eat it by the time we get there. And as long as we don't get lost. So we need another jacket. We need better pants, another pair of socks, um, ideally more earmuffs. These, I think these are really good hats. Um, you can get better gloves that give you or warmth. We're not very rested. That perfect, beautiful day. Clear sight. Um, clear sight. It's warm. Uh, it's actually a little bit afternoon, but. It's not too late. Probably if we can make it to this cabin, this is the third attempt now, um, we'll spend the night there. All right, so there's our little friend. The dead body. I have half a mind to get that gut. Um, with the knife, it's pretty fast, even when it's frozen, I think. Let's see how, how long it takes, it's, since it's such nice weather. The last couple times I played this game, I, I put wolves on passive, but I made the, the, the coldness just ridiculous. And it's, it's like negative, you know, 30 degrees every day. Um, and it's it's hard in a different different way. Hey, bad gamer, how's it going, man? <clears throat> um, so we just took a we just took a second shot at trying to get to this cabin, and we found a deer along the way, and I decided to kill it, and. I actually managed to shoot it and just took all everything back home. So we're going out again. Let me get this gut. And uh, I'll take another shot. I'm quite well. I am excited to be playing this game. I was really nervous about playing this game on stream for some reason. It's so, it's so different than playing Paladins or something like that. Um, for some reason it just makes my adrenaline go through the roof. Um, I think in Paladins people make my adrenaline go through the roof, but that's also kind of different. So we don't have any materials for making a fire. That was um, that was short-sighted of me. Get a slight arc vibe? No, not this game. I mean, okay, maybe. I see what you're saying in that 
Like if you turn a corner and it's a T-Rex, you're scared at some point, but the difference is in that game eventually you get strong enough you get good dinosaurs that it's not really scary to come up on a t-rex in this game you, you never you're always a moment away from death um, no rest I think there's like a little lake over there but I'm I'm gonna stick to this direction um, like, even though we have a gun, we're very, very... weak. Yeah, always. Even with the best clothes in the game, and a fully repaired uh, rifle, all it takes is, um, is a bear coming on top of you when you're, when you're injured or tired or cold and that's pretty much it. You can even fall through the ice um, and just... I you used to die instantly. I think they changed that so that it just does damage. But it's pretty crazy. So if you walk around and you're not fully healed, you'll wind up like this guy. Hate when bears come on top of you. Mm -hmm. I bet you do. I kind of like it myself. I don't know what you've got against it. So, okay, I, this this rings a bell. This area rings a bell. I, it's. I don't know when to cut over, so we're just going to look up on this cliff and probably come upon a, a wolf. Hey, Delvina. You thought about saying coming coming up on a on a bear? Sorry, coming up on a bear. I mean a bear coming. What you know what I'm saying? I want to see what's this looks interesting, doesn't it? Um. Oh, Max's last stand. Poor Max. Doesn't have anything with him. Um, uh, I think it's this way. He clicked my video to watch an accident and made a clip. That's okay. I think, um, I think clips are pretty cool even when they're random. This is it. This is it. This is it. All right, so here's the thing. There's usually a bear, and is probably wolvies. Oh, look, it's a cairn. Um, so these come from the backers who's, who did the, you know, uh, what do you call it? Early access. There's like a thousand in, just in hidden little nooks and crannies. All right, so we've got a we've got a deer. I am not going to shoot it. We've shot enough things for now. Um, there's a corpse, and I think I, I don't see it, but I think the cabin. Oh, there's the cabin. <laughs> uh, it's right in front of me. Let's just um, let's just take it easy and, and uh, it, it's a visual thing. It's kind of oh shit. Oh my god, there's so many dead animals. Did you hear that? Um, I'm eating that so that we don't smell. So, I feel like we should check this out. It's got two pounds of... Of, of meat and and a hide all right let's get the meat um, so it's a visual thing we actually are wearing mittens let's let's do it 50 minutes is a long time who knows what could happen in 50 minutes but I'm doing it 
I see the cabin in the distance, so what could go wrong, right? Beautiful, beautiful. I keep hearing weird noises. Yeah, I, I really wish that um, that it showed the gloves you're wearing because I'm wearing these cute little uh, mittens. I think mittens are just adorable. They're like toe socks for the hands. All right, I don't see anything, so I'm just going across this open field. I feel like there's snipers looking at me. Trapper's homestead. That's it. This is this is what we've been looking for. Do you hear that? Oh yeah yeah yeah. See, like some kind of sick mime oh it's a rabbit come back here so we can make some really nice mittens if we kill um, a, a few rabbits Oh, that was close. That wasn't. Um, see, we're gonna come across, uh, come upon this crest. It's gonna be wolves. I know it. I've totally lost the rabbit. Oh, there it is. There's no reticle. You have your hand. Um, oh, you see these saplings? So, let's see. Birch saplings can be used to make arrows. All right. No oh, fucking shit. Stay down, bitch. <laughs> um, we got him. We got him, folks. You see a reticle when I pick things up? Yeah, it goes away for the rabbit just to make it just to make it that much more annoying. How do I get in here? Yeah, so the it's kind of it's kind of um, funny, but the the rocks just stun them, and you have to kill you have to snap their neck before they wake up. Um, all right, so we're gonna survive. The problem is I'm not exactly sure where we came from. I think I think it was that barn. So we came from straight ahead and then to the left. So we'll have to we we'll have to find our way home tomorrow, but for now let's take a look at what's in here. Oh yeah, we're gonna get so much stuff. Jerry can can't take the soap. Oh, an MRE that's like delicious food and it's great for ASMR videos. Got another safe sewing kit. Snare, we can maybe put that somewhere. Lots of food. So right now we're carrying around a rabbit corpse. Um, and we can basically decide where to gut that oh, sweatshirt. Um, 
we can decide where to cut that and then cook it. And that'll, I think, give us one of the pelts we need. Five rounds. Fantastic. Oh, this is a real gold mine here. We gotta, we gotta get a pry bar at some point. You wanted to hear that when you had me minimized. <laughs> uh, I'm sure that's what you say when you minimize me. Stay down, bitch. Um, all right, I, that's all I see except for the safe. So quite a haul, quite a haul. Um. A bunch of views. Well, because, you know, because I'm super popular. That's obviously. Um, we might need to make some fire to make water. All right, about 35. Um, uh, something like 15-ish. Okay. Okay, just past 15. So 35. 15-ish. Got. Okay, a flare, a book. Oh, that's a terrible. That's terrible. Okay, those two things um, are not really what I was hoping for. You have thoughts and feelings about that clip. What? What clip? The banished clip, or what are you talking about? No amount of context can make that okay. What did I say? The hell is that? Oh, I think it's the deer. Um. All right, so it's it's kind of getting late. I think we could make it home. I think we can make it home. That's probably a terrible idea. Um, we're overburdened when the boat didn't come. Oh man, that was that was something, huh? For for like years. You can use this to make um, bandages that have, I think, antibacterial properties. Let's grab some sticks. I saw another rabbit. Maybe we can get him. They're, they're like five or six pounds, though, so that's, that's pretty heavy. Um... Yeah, so we have to make this decision. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get these. Um, oh, it's more of these. I'm gonna get these sticks. Because who knows what's the future has in store for us? Try to kill this rabbit. If we kill the rabbit, we're definitely staying. Yeah. Boom! Fucking. Sniper over here. Oh, my aim is tried and true. 
which is it's it's kind of amazing because when I play this alone, Whew, this pack is getting kind um, of it took me like eight shots to kill a deer once. So. Like eight bullets, <laughs> which might not sound like a lot, but when you're counting every bullet, it really matters. Don't want to spend any bullets. You don't have to. Oh fucking shit! Okay. Staying here tonight. <sighs> Adrenaline. It's so, it's so funny. It's just a game. It's just a game. But um, I think the thing that is so fantastic about this game, and you you might not get it watching it, but it's like a it's like a roguelike. It's like NetHack or, or, or some, you know, some one game. One of the, <laughs> it's like these games called roguelikes in that when you die, that's it. And all the stuff that you've worked on and all the plans you've made and all the little um, little stashes you've, you've planted, they're, they're all irrelevant. In, in a blink of an instant. All right. Hopefully he'll be gone tomorrow. Um, I hit his toe, it doesn't count. You, you, you be quiet there. So this place doesn't have a fireplace, I don't think. Okay, I lied. Um, let's kill some rabbits. Ooh, can I do this in the dark? Okay. Same with this one. Um, so you see our stats are not looking so hot. But now we've got some raw meat. I'm going to go ahead. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to sleep like an hour. So let's drink. Oh man. Um we both got quiet when that wolf showed up. I assume it's for a different reason than being scared. Um, I totally cannot see. And now I don't know where the bed is. Fuck. All right. It looks like we're just going to sleep. What, what, what do you want from us? <clears throat> I, it's, it, so I, I'm curious. I mean, when that wolf showed up, my heart leapt into my throat. And it's, it's that same, it's the same feeling playing NetHack 
when I realize I've just done something very stupid and I'm close to death or maybe even dead already. Um, it's like, it's, this, it's the feeling you get when you're pulled over by the cops. Um, like, fuck. I'm screwed over. I'm screwed now. Um, <laughs> political. Is it is it really even political to say that, like, you feel scared when the cops show up? I feel like that's just an an agreed upon thing. You see me kill a couple wolves. I see. Yeah. Well. Uh, you know, when you're as good at this game as I am, it makes it look easy, but... Alright, let's, um... Let's cook some of this meat. Slash all of it. Do we even have the wood for this? What am I doing? Like, I guess we can break down some chairs. Come on, little fire. Oh, look, it's a little note. To the left, um... Next to the chair. So, how kind of strap? Well, yeah, you, but you saw, you saw me get mauled by the wolf in the video, right? In the video last night, and that wolf got me down to thirty-eight health out of a hundred. Oh yeah, thirty-eight percent. Um. Let's go ahead and pop this in. We, we don't need the weight. So to heal, you have to have all of your your four stats, your temperature, your tiredness, your thirst, and your hunger. They all need to be white. And then you need to sleep. Um, that's pretty much like you have to rest. That's That's pretty much the only way to heal. I think that is the only way to heal. Um, so, so for example, if you're, if you're outside and you've been attacked by a wolf and you're tired, you, you will not regain health and anything else that happens can kill you just like that. <clears throat> um, I mean, a wolf can kill you instantly, um, oh, I could if you don't fight like him that. off. And um, I think it, it matters what kind of clothes you're wearing. If, you're, if your clothes are ragged, they do more damage. You can get an infection. So if we hadn't have put bandages on those wounds, you can get an infection and that'll kill you. It's, I was telling Bad Gamer, at no point in this game is it better than you're next to death. Like, Everything you do is one step away from death. <clears throat> um, which may not come across because I'm super good at it. Cooking! We leveled up cooking. All right, let's read this note. You won't remember me. The world doesn't stop when the lights fade. This is how it begins. Stay calm, observe, survive. Your father saw this day. Don't believe what you hear. What he did was for a far off dawn. Maybe you recall the fire? Your father understood that we dance for our children's children's children. My dear, one day you will feel the voices rise in your heart. Enter a cave and stand until stars appear. Climb the highest peak. Sing when the brutality hits. I'm here with you. The winter winds can only get so cold. That's actually not true. The winter continues to get colder as you play the game um, until it's like negative 100 degrees outside. Oh! I'm really glad we read that note because I thought we'd pick this place clean. This rifle cleaning kit is what I really want. Um, 
With the rifle cleaning kit, we can repair our rifle. Holy shit! Okay. Let's, um... Let's eat this venison. Winter winds do stop getting cold when you have hypothermia. <laughs> um... Alright, I'm gonna break down... Is there anything easier to break down? Break down these boxes. Crates, crates. And... Is that, is that really it? Um, we're gonna make some water. I... I shouldn't, I shouldn't actually do this, but this is what I'm doing. Let's melt. Let's do 20. What are you clipping? What, what did I do that was clippable? Other than read a backer's note. Alright, this will give us enough water to get back home, assuming that we don't get lost. Which... It's kind of a big assumption. Let's hope the weather is good. Thank you, Nightbot. How are you, Nightbot? Are you enjoying yourself? That's what matters. Okay. So we've got all the necessities. We've got water. We've got food. Oh, we, we need to eat more. Let's, let's eat the meat. I think... So rabbit doesn't have a whole lot of calories in it. Should use that scream from the clip you made. Maybe you find it on it. What scream? From what clip? I mean, the only scream I can think of is a scream that you made on stream when the seagulls attack. I can't I can't watch a television. I can't watch a clip. Um just just tell me when when what did I when was the when was the clip? Or get a sub. Like a submarine sandwich? What are you talking about? You guys are confusing me. All right, let's see if the wolf is gone. Let's go ahead and get ready for him. So we're we're up to 17 bullets. Um, oh, it just happened? I didn't scream. I... You ulated. Enjoy. All right. We need to make it across and then left, I think. It's snowing, visibility's low. But we don't have meat on us. So hopefully there won't be any bulls. Whew. Oh man, we got a rifle cleaning kit. So. I feel, you know, a little bit better. Every shot was bringing us closer to this thing. I think it has a chance to jam when it has low durability. Um, and that can obviously be a bad thing. Um, okay. Isn't that pretty? Isn't this where we came from? And we saw the deer there. So, how do we... Oh, there's the thing, I think. Okay. I think... I think it's just like up here-ish. All of it looks the same. Yeah, that's the problem, is that it's fucking... Everything's covered in snow. Uh, 
Oh, I think those are the mountains. So we sort of followed some mountains on the way in. I'm going to pick up uh, like one more stick just in case. If, if, if it starts to blizzard, we need to be able to make a, a fire. And yeah, see, here's the tree that looks so interesting and it had birds above it. You remember. You remember. So we came from this way. Oh, what a fantastic expedition. And it's Buick LeSabre is not so bad either. Now, there's a bunch of stuff out here in the middle of the woods. The problem is, it, it all looks the same. And um, I, I get lost so easily. Why do I live in Wolfland? Nuclear winter? Um, it's, not, um, it's not clear. Oh, I think I see the I think I see this the electrical poles. What's that? Um, we're we're going in the right direction. It's it's not exactly clear. Um, at the beginning of the survival mode, it just says something happened to your plane, some kind of electrical disturbance or something, and then you. You found yourself here. So we were pilot. That's that's pretty much it. Now the story mode is like a prequel, or maybe sort of, and I don't really know what that says because I've never played it. <laughs> but um, so this well, it's kind of Siberia. It's Canada. It's um. It's cold because Canada. But the reason why everybody's gone and why there's no electricity except during the Aurora, um, that isn't clear. Like, everything just stopped working. So it's some kind of apocalyptic thing. But, um, but no idea what. Um, you can find your plane, actually, at the top of some mountain. And I, I don't think I've ever made it. But. Um, but there's no way to escape. I, I think. I, I just, I like the idea that everyone's just dead, you know. At least in this place. Um, now, if only you could hunt all the wolves. And then they would stay dead. It might be kind of peaceful. Canada after Justin Bieber died. Is, is Justin Bieber Canadian? I didn't know that. I did hear... Um, shit, I don't even remember his name. Never mind. Canada when Justin Bieber reproduces. He's, uh, uh, Delvina. That can't be right, because Justin Bieber is hot, not cold. Oh my god, look. It's a, it's another deer, like, right next to our house. I, I can't shoot it, though. I mean, we've shot so many animals. He 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 scared. He got scared. All right. Oh shit. Is he coming back? What do you, what do you think? Should we? Um.
This is probably a bad idea. Because if I miss, we're just down a bullet. Uh oh, but I don't miss. Yeah, save your bullets for the wolves. Probably a good idea, but I couldn't resist. Um. All right, let's, uh, 18 pounds of meat. So it's kind of cold. It's kind of cold. Dead shot. Um, we want the hide and we want the meat, but it's kind of cold. Let's start a little bitty fire. Little, just a little bitty fire. You know what I didn't get is matches. We've shot so many animals. Something you only want to hear a photographer say, or a dentist. <laughs> uh, I get that reference. Um, so this will let us make some pants. And you know how much I like pants. I don't. All right, we're just going to carve the shit out of this thing. Um, actually, let's do... All right, so what's going to happen is the fire's going to die. It's going to get cold. Then we're going to start taking damage. Oh, it didn't, it didn't, uh, didn't go so quick, so... We're good. Pantsless stream for the win. I mean, let's put it this way. I'm not going to tell you one way or the other. Yeah, You're just going to have to use more. your imagination. All right. Uh, another defenseless creature killed. Not for our pleasure, but for our survival. We'll put its meat next to the rest of the meat. All right. Wow, what a fantastically successful trip. We've got enough food for over a week, I think. Is that what I tell myself? Um. Look, if if I didn't kill him, the wolves would kill him. So, uh, actually, some of the people who are really good at this game will lure the wolves to kill deer for them. That's like an advanced uh, tactic, and they they essentially use the wolves to do all the dirty work, and then they come back when the wolves are gone and they eat they scavenge um, I am scared shitless of wolves and will never do that in a bajillion years can the wolves eat the meat you drop they they can but they probably won't they don't usually come all the way to this house um, I they might not be able to. So there's this thing called drop decoy. And it essentially means like if you've got meat or something, you can drop it to to, to distract the wolves. And I know that they can eat that. But I maybe it's different if you just drop it on the ground. I don't know. I've never experimented. Like I said, I'm terrified of wolves. So there's no there's no way for me to save. That's kind of what that fear comes down to. I can't save and load if something goes wrong. It's just death. So that's why I don't know much about exactly how wolves work, because I haven't played with them. Um, Alright, let's put a few little things away. 
our, our rifle's down to 26. Probably we shouldn't have shot it. We, we really need to clean it. We've been lucky. But what can I say? Um, let's put that away. Maybe a bandage. Put a bandage away. I don't think we need all of that. I can't remember how many antibiotics you need, which is probably a bad thing. All right, we've got our first cured deer pelt, and we've got three total. So I think that's enough for the pants. And it's definitely enough for the boots. The boots are actually warmer, but I guess it depends on what we have, which is a better upgrade. Um, I think the pants are kind of heavy. They're both, um, both 4.4 pounds. So our current boots, 2.2. So it's twice as heavy as these trail boots. Um, and, it, and it's four times as heavy as our jeans. So that's, that's a lot of weight. But, but it's warm. All right, let's see if we can fit that stuff in here. Um, probably need a better system than just putting cured deer hide in the drawer somewhere. This looks like a scene of a of a crime. If we can get a couple more rabbits, we can make mittens. And I think those are light. I think rabbit mittens are like cool. Um, they're not super light. No, they're not super light, but they're good. They resist water and they're warm. Uh, okay. So we need to gather food, um, uh, wood, and we need to make a buttload of water so that we have a supply and we don't have to worry about it every day. We need to clean our gun. I need to get matches. I'm going to get that now before I forget. And we got this storm lantern, which I'm just gonna. What a what a great haul. Alright, we've got a jerry can full of uh, oil. We're probably not going to use 10 bullets. So I'm going to put the extra away. Uh, put the sewing kit. All right. And we'll put the MRE and the peaches. Save them for a rainy day. So we've got enough water for like a day. The weather was getting a little bit hairy. But there might be enough time to gather some wood. Oh yeah, we got this wet shirt. I didn't check it out. How does that look? Um... It's not as good as the plaid shirt, I don't think. It's also not as cute.
Did we we ate all that meat? We ate all that meat. God, it's she just swallows the stuff like like a vacuum. All right, let's get wood while we um, still can. Now we can get wood from like the chairs inside the house, but I think I think we can take like one piece of wood if we find something. I don't I don't mean the sticks. Um, there was a big branch across the way. Let's see if it's still there. Yeah. So it takes an hour, I think we'll be good. You never know how the <clears throat> how the weather can change while you're doing that, and you can't stop it. Which doesn't make much realistic sense, but it's a game. Um, but we're still good, so let's... Grab a couple more sticker rooms here. I think we'll even do a branch room. It's getting it's getting about that time. Jesus. Um We've been pretty lucky with weather in terms of when we travel, but it's totally possible, quite likely, that eventually we'll get caught in a blizzard. Um, should we just sleep through the night, or should we... All right. Um, so I, I need to spend about a day making water, just like a whole day. Um, I might as well do that tomorrow. Okay. Stumbling about. This is like when you have to go to the bathroom at two in the morning. And uh, it's down the hall. You don't want to turn on a light because it would hurt. So you stub your toe on the bed, then you stub your toe on the door, and then you stub your toe on the little table that's in the hallway. And you think, why is there a table in the hallway? Like, what, what do we have to hold? We've survived eight days, eight hours. <clears throat> I think that's enough sleep. Um, Jesus, I can't see anything though. So we're gonna just make water. And okay. All right, we need to grab a book. Jesus. Okay. Beautiful. Oh, right. Let's make, I mean, at least. Come on, little fire. Uh, at least a bajillion. At least a bajillion water. 
so that um, we can just grab it whenever we need it. Wow, that didn't work. Okay, let's try again. There goes one of our matches. Can you can you feel the feel the warmth coming off of it? I can. Buttes. All right, so this is the cedar fire we've got from that um, tree outside. Let's let's go ahead and just crank it up. Um, how much food do we have? Shit! Shit! Only two pieces. So maybe we should um, maybe we should grab some some more meat. Venison or venison? Okay. So, let's cook a little bit first. All right, let's go ahead and do a big water thing. See how long this takes. Let's do... Uh, let's do that much. I sh at some point I should remember how long it takes, but uh, maybe we'll test it now. <clears throat> uh, okay, it's about 220. Boiling a gal... Uh, a gallon? I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Yeah, so it took about an hour and 20 minutes to boil a gallon, to melt a gallon. All right, it's, uh, it's one hour now. So boil took 40 minutes. I'm not going to remember. Sure, you don't drink the unboiled one. All right, let's put all right, let's do couple so the coffee helps you um, learn cooking and it's it's useful when you need to go on a long expedition it doesn't take long to make And I don't think it degrades once you've made it. Alright. We're going to be expert cooks before long.
so I mentioned before that uh, if if you're like a level five cook or something, you you don't get food poisoning from food that you cooked. Um, but there's advantages before you get there. I think I think it gives you a little bit of extra calories. Okay, so that's so it's actually getting light out. Let's um. Boil this. So I think this will give us about two gallons. Maybe we'll see if we can get another. Did I already forget how long it took? Whew, this pack is getting kind of heavy. So that's not a whole day. We've got we've got some time now to go to go do something. But we're looking mighty pretty. So I'm gonna start dropping the water on the ground now because there's so much. I'll just put it here. Alright, three point four gallons. Alright, we've got all this cooked meat. Let's throw some of that in the, the old fridge here. Grab that. fire go out? I think it did. So you can make um, this, a drink that has, I think, pain properties from rosehip. Um, there's another one that is antimicrobial, I think you make from mushrooms. All right, well, we're a little bit on the heavy side. Oh yeah, the coffee. the water. Okay. Let's take a look at this book. We haven't seen how long it takes to read. Oh, it's only four hours. Oh, yeah. So this will actually help us aim better. Oh crap. Well that was a mistake. Maybe we should take a little a little nap before trying again. Don't want to make the same mistake twice. So that would have been maybe a good time to take the tea. It, it helps you rest so that you gain more sleep. Because um, we don't want to run out of daylight. And I'm not sure how much is left. I need to find a place to rest. Okay. We still, we still haven't skilled up, 
but we're pretty close, I think. Sounds like it's kind of nasty outside. Well, let's see if we can't go... I mean, maybe it's not cold, and maybe we can grab a little bit of wood. And if not, then we'll clean our gun. Because <clears throat> I don't think we can go anywhere with all this wind. It's actually pretty warm. Well, not in the wind. But... Let's go look for a branch. If we see any rabbits, I think there are rabbits over here. But if we see any rabbits, we put down the trap. sure how to get to them. Okay. So I think at this point we're going to start taking health damage. Once you get to the red and something. I also can't sprint. I'm just hoping that I can find a branch. This is how you get up here. Looks like looks like we can keep climbing. from home, but I've definitely gotten lost here before. Did you hear that? Sounds like a wolf. Oh, there's a patch. There's another. I think, I think there's a cave. Oh, a skill book. 
This stuff will come in handy. And a bullet. I can hardly see anything. That's, that's a good find. It's kind of late. There's a climbing <coughs> rope that we could take if we wanted to move it somewhere, put, you know, put it somewhere else. I think this is the other side of that rope we saw, maybe? Actually, probably not. Not sure exactly where that goes. Oh, there's the rabbits. Okay, so I'll just put um, just put our trap down. Can't craft snare rabbits right in the path of the little rabbit feces. Um. Oof. Oof, it's getting cold. We're really slow. Oh, no, that's not what I want. Fucking fucking A, man. <clears throat> Sun is setting. Let's see if I can get one more. All right, that's it. It's too. It's getting too dark. <clears throat> I think if I did it again, it would be um, it would be nighttime. Getting cold too. Oh, actually, we're warming up. Oh no. Oh no. Maybe it's not attacking. I can't run. I also think it's going to be hard to shoot on these hills. Fuck. I could drop a decoy. Oh, damn it. Oh, fuck. So the game makes sure to save when you take injury. Um, thanks, game. So I sprained my ankle. I'm exhausted. I'm overburdened, and there's a wolf chasing me. In 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 the blink of an eye, things go south. But I think I'm gonna make it home. Gosh. Okay. So let's take a look. Um, two painkillers or a cup of... This is like pain medication. It's probably rose. Um, how do you... Is there no way we can just like, hey, go ahead and do it? Okay.
All right, so that fixed the sprained ankle. Um, I'm going to hop step outside. And oops, harvest. Since it's still warm out. Um, usually you can do this kind of stuff at night outside. Um, whereas it wouldn't let you inside because it's too it's too dark. And I'm just gonna hopefully we can find this. I'm just gonna drop this pelt in the gut right where we stand. All right, let's let's eat that. Drink that. Let's step back outside to put the meat, the raw meat, in the snow. And then I think we'll just uh, go to bed. Uh, we got to remember that's a different door than we usually use. Okay. Beautiful. So, we want to grab some food. Save the soda. All right, we'll, we'll put everything else away tomorrow. So let's um, let's go to sleep. That could have gone a lot worse. I think when we're walking around overburdened, do you get the sounds like pots and pans clanging around sound? All right, so we've got all of our stats in the white. We should heal the little bit of health we lost. It's not too big of a deal. It was just a tiny bit, but. Now, what, what should we do next? That's pretty much all the places I know how to get to. I didn't act accidentally tear those things down. I just uh, thought it was just about morning. Okay. All right, let's go drop all the wood and crap we picked up. <clears throat> so. There's the rabbit stuff. I, I think I'll leave that there. It's pretty easy to see. All right, so let's put, I think it's mostly fur. Six pieces of fur. That's a good, uh, that's a good haul. Two pieces of 
cedar. Uh, a lot of sticks. We used all of our sticks up. Um, so this is a great book. This will um, give you more meat when you cut up an animal. It takes 10 hours to research, um, but we'll put the fishing book away. All right, uh, we got some rocks. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna clean the gun because if we had to use it and it had misfired and it might have been bad. Um, and I think this actually has its own skill too, but it's it doesn't it's not visible. So. Oh, it is, it is. Cleaning skill increased 31. So these rifle cleaning kits are super finite in the sense that there's a certain amount of guns, there's a certain amount of kits in the world. You might not find them all. In fact, it's likely you won't. And when they're gone, they're gone. Uh, some of the other things, it's a lot easier to stretch them out. You can actually repair um, like your hacksaw a lot, but not the guns. Twenty uses. Um, it goes from let's see, fifty-four percent up to fifty-eight percent. So four times twenty, so about eighty. So we'll have maybe one use left once we get it all the way up. Uh, bad luck with the gun being in such low condition when we found it. I remember my my dad cleaning his hunting um, guns on the kitchen table sometimes when I was very little. He'd disassemble them and I don't know, put little pipe cleaner things and oil other things. Seemed complicated to me, but I was like four years old, so. All right, one more time, I think. <clears throat> That'll be as far as I want to go up. Oh, that was it. That was the uh, that was the end of the kit. So that kit. Took us to a um, just about a hundred percent. All right. Well, we did it. That was one of our goals, and we did it. Now that's just um, broken. It's it's completely useless for us. So I'll just we'll start like a little trash pile over here. Um, yeah, I'd, I'd love not to carry the gun around, but these, these wolves are ridiculous in this game. So let's... What do we want to do?
We could head back to the dam and pick up the stuff that we uh, left. Or we could move to the dam. Um, we could try to find the the tower. There's some kind of like a like a ranger station, you know. Um, they've moved it since I used to play. I'm not sure where the new one is. Make the wound dressing, I think, prudent to go ahead and do that. All right. that in there until we find some more. Um, maybe we should grab another two painkillers. All right. How's our pelts? All right. Can't really do anything just yet. They're still drying. Let's take a step outside to see what we've got going on. Oh, I think I wanted to put the cloth away. I forgot to do that. That's a nice day. Um, how about we make a trip up the river to the dam and pick up all the, so we probably have to sleep at the hydro plant. Um, but we'll head, we'll head up and pick up all the cattails. So I'll take um, some meat to eat. That's probably enough water. Um, this is kind of dangerous because there's probably going to be bugs. And if there's wolves, I'm going to feel obligated to get the meat. I don't know if I'll be able to resist. Um, one of the things I want from the from the um, dam, to the hydro dam, is uh, those shoes, because now we're in a much better place uh, in terms of being able to repair things. We've got all the leather, and things were pretty hectic when we left. We wanted to be underweight. So another thing we could do that's insane, but we could try to kill that deer. I mean, that, uh, the bear. We've got a gun that's, I think, guaranteed not to jam. Well, 
Wow, there's two wolves. You see the that one? Looks like an ant. Oh, three wolves. Or is that just a piece of some? At least two. Well, so much for that. I mean, we could we could drop meat. We could drop a flare. Neither are guaranteed. And from what I un understand from the Reddit, oh Jesus, they don't work as well as they used to. Oh dear. Um, the wind's picking up anyway, so. It actually makes it harder to walk. I, the game actually models wind and wind direction and stuff. Pretty neat way. So, so here, check. I probably showed you this, but... Look, it's hard to walk into the wind, but then when you get over to a wall, the little icon on the top means we're guarded from the wind. And... Um, our temperature's going up. The, f the, the wind chill um, doesn't affect you as much. Let's see if it changes. All right, so we're out in the wind. Now it's negative 20 instead of negative two. So the wind is, um, it's more significant. I think that's a really neat thing. So, hey, you see that? That's either the tower that I want to go to or it's the burned down broken version uh, that was the old tower. I, I'm not actually sure. If I thought if I thought we could keep it in sight, I think we should just sort of try to find it by wandering. But now's not the day to do it, I, I don't think. Um, we certainly need to get more water and food, at least. Or did we do that before? Yeah, 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 we, we did that. So, I mean, it's not a terrible idea. Can, can you even get behind trees, I think, for shelter from the wind? It's pretty cool. Um, We've got this sleeping bag, which just seems like extra weight. Probably the wolf notices because of the meat, but you know, we didn't have meat that first time we were attacked, at the very beginning of the game. Okay. Be walking into the wind too. Let's let's do it tomorrow. Um, we'll we'll try the same thing again tomorrow. We'll try to go to to the dam via the lake. And if there's if there's wolves, then we'll try going to the to the tower. Oh. Um, the tower is really far away, like it's up at the top of a mountain. So you wouldn't want to live there, but there's a bed, there's a stove, I think. Nice supply of wood. Fucking shit. Oh, that was chasing me, I think. Where am I? Oh. 
We skilled up in firearm. Oh my god, it's like I I'm filled with adrenaline. So did you see it come over the mountain? I couldn't get a good shot for a while. Whew. Should we Let's do, since we have so much wood, we might as well do this. Um, that way, if there's another one, Jesus. I mean, there are so many wolves in this map, in this game. Come on, little fire. What? I need another wolf pelt. I think we need four to make the coat. So, I think. I think we need one more after this. Might be worth sticking around before. Oh yeah. That's good. Fire starting. We leveled it up in fire starting. hours to, to do it without a knife, a weapon. But every time you use the knife, the percentage goes down. And you have to sharpen it, and then the whetstones go down. And you can't repair whetstones. Yeah, I, I, I got it. I shot it. Okay, we're severely overburdened. But... Killed something else. Ooh. Fresh... I don't think I've ever seen him come like up here. Ugh, it's dark already. It's so nice outside. I'm going to see if I can read a couple of, uh, right? It's only a little bit cold. So temperature's dropping pretty quickly. Oh, I think I need to lay down. I'd try to do another hour, but I think it's going to be too cold. And then they, um, it, you lose the time. Okay, we should try to grab some... Oh, this, this is not the door that we usually go into. So... That's all the meat we cooked? Oh my god, it goes so fast. I mean, she basically eats like a whole deer every day. 
which I think is a little excessive. Whew, we, we didn't get far from home. Um, but it was productive. Lots of wood. Another carcass. Uh, no injuries. All right, it's nice and early. We don't have anything to do for once. Um, so I want to try to head back to the dam. This time we'll leave. Uh, the sleeping bag. Let's drop off. Uh, some of this wood? I, I think all of it. <clears throat> all right. We have rocks. We can probably drop them. I, I was thinking there might be bunnies uh, when I picked them up. I think at the top of that mountain. Let's get, oh, it appears we'll need to cook some, some meat. The more you carry, the smellier you get. Okay. This will take a little bit. So see our percentages, ooh, don't use that, are much higher than they were before. Instead of 75, it's 90 uh, with the book. Um, right, so we'll cook this meat. We'll eat. It sucks because I want to carry the meat. Um, really? One out of ten chance. Um, so we'll. Yeah, if we carry the meat, the wolves are going to be more attracted to us. Come on, little fire. Come on. And they seem to be the primary antagonists. So, but at the very least, I'm, I want to fill up on meat and then bring sodas or something. Because um, the idea is we're going to pick cattails in the way, so we should have some cattails.
might have to use another piece of wood. Uh-oh. If it goes out, you got to start it all over again. It's kind of a pain. It'll say like embers, but I think it's random how long they last. Uh, you know what I want to do? Now that we have this little bitty fire here, get some rose hips. Prepare some rose hips. I think it takes 15 minutes. Um, pretty sure this is a painkiller, and it's not renewable. These things don't grow back, but it, it will supplant your, you know, finding painkiller medication. has an emergency supply of water too. <clears throat> you drink it and uh, gives you some water. I think it may be a tiny bit of food too, like a very small amount, like a hundred calories or something. if we should keep it with the medicine or the food. All right. So finally, the big question is, should we carry meat with us? I, I think we have to not. It's just too risky. So we'll fill up. We got a book. We'll pick up some sticks. All right. And it's early enough-ish that hopefully we can get back. It's kind of risky. Kind of risky. It's nice and warm. Okay. So I think we learned a lesson. Just going to start carrying this thing around. Now, if there was some way I could skirt these fellas. Like maybe climb up the ridge and go down that rope. I don't see anything. But there were, there were two of them. That's a uh, deer. There were two of them. Oh shit. Now that's a wolf. There's two wolves. God damn it. He's coming for me. He's coming for me. I can't even see. He's like three pixels big and he's coming for me. Like, seriously?
I think he's saying he sent it away. Um, I th whatever we set it to, I think we have to tone down a little next time because this is ridiculous. Uh, all right, plan two, plan B. Actually, I'll pick that up. Um, Hi, Kitterman. How are you? Welcome. Um, plan B, we're going to try to find the tower that we saw in the distance. And hopefully the wolves won't bother us. I think I can use this. How is there a rifle cartridge here? Did we, did the gun jam? Or something? Maybe, maybe it jammed. Alright, so we want to head up there, I think. And basically just going to try to keep it in view. And see if we can, uh, see if we can find it. So, last time we passed by those railroad tracks, there was a, a wolf. So let's go this way. Um, and we should pick up sticks on the way, because I don't think I have any. Uh, how are you tonight, Kitterman? Something. Rabbit. Multiple rabbits. Oh, uh... Okay, and be uh, old man's beard or whatever. Let's grab a couple of those. Maybe we should have put the trap here. Um, so, we see it. So, hopefully, we can just follow it around till we find an entrance. It's getting kind of steep, though. Don't, I don't want to see any... Oh. We only have two cattails. Because I thought we'd be finding more cattails. Food is the least sort of urgent need, I feel. But still sucks not to have it. Still see it. Now, are we going to be able to find our way back? Hopefully, we can see the railroad tracks. Such a great landmark. Uh oh, too steep. Oh, man. Oh, there's a. Oh, shit. No, fuck. Uh, puncture. It's... Alright. Um, 
blood loss wolf bite, infection risk wolf bite. So let's take this dude, apply. Need some first aid. So I think that's. Oh, it needs a bandage. Okay. Okay. Um. Well, that that um, that sucks. So the prudent thing to do would be to go back home and rest up. Or the less prudent thing to do would be to take to follow this trail of blood and kill the wolf. Who, who wronged us? So I know that they bleed out, and we used a knife. Now it's, it's also just as likely to come up on him, and he's pissed. It's blood. A lot of dead stuff up there. It's, how do you get up there? That's that's it. Is he dead? think we need to... I don't think we can. I was going to make a fire, but I don't think we have the stuff. Screw you, wolf! So it's just afternoon. That looks pretty interesting. But I don't think we should get too distracted. Let's keep following this around. Let's hope that we don't find another aggressive... Oh, speaking of aggressive wolves, we're carrying meat. And we should really make a fire. Cook it, at least. Gotta be way up. I think those are the trailers that we took shelter in that first night. <sighs> How do you get up? Is that it? So there's branches though. I think I need some wood. There's definitely definitely the trailers. We really don't have to go far from home to uh, to find adventure. So, how the 
hell? Did I get up? Damn bull hole. That hurts. What the hell? God damn it. How does she sprain her wrist? Oh no, I can't shoot the gun with a sprained wrist. Wow, we actually have the rose hip tea. That only healed the It only healed the ankle, so we can't shoot the gun unless we drink the other cup. I guess we drink both. It's a pretty easy decision. Man, that was bad luck. Jesus. I'm thinking maybe we shouldn't go up there. I have no clue how to get up there. It's getting cold. I mean, it's not getting cold, but it's getting windy. So, I mean, I think the railroad is that way. Uh, if, if worse, well. Um, I pretty much know how to get to the dam from here, from the Isobolf. like it's not too steep. Oh, it's too steep. God damn it, that wolf. These wolves are insane. All right, I'm at the risk of breaking my ankle again. Actually, that might have been it. Well, change of change of plans. Let's head up and see what's up here. If this is the right way. Still doesn't feel quite inviting. Oh, I see stairs. I don't see the railroad. Um, so there's stairs over there, but this is clearly not the way to get to them. <clears throat> we may have simply climbed. Hell, where is it? Is that how you do it? Fucking... Oh my god. I'll tell you one thing. Wait, did it not hurt me? How come you can't click it? That's frustrating. Stop the bleeding before it gets worse. I don't know which one it is. You have to look at that one to see what to apply, and this one to do it. It's just kind of silly. Infection. Uh... Well, let's go home. This is it's gonna be bad, isn't it? 
I don't even know where home is. That's that's a thing. I think it's this way. Oh, there's the train. Okay. So, good God, we didn't. We didn't even make it up there. Oh Lord. Oh, that's not good. So I know from experience that you can find your way into a place where the only choice is to jump. And that's not, um, it's not usually a good thing to do. <clears throat> so the further I go this way, the more risk we have running into more wolves. Oh no. Speaking of wolves, I think that wolf must have gone this way. Just saw fresh blood. Yep. Oh my god, that's another one, isn't it? Look, there's another wolf. This is absurd. That looks like a fart. That looks like a long drop. So, I don't know if we can get through there. Might make sense to start a fire and cook the meat. Hey, Lurker. Well, it's. I think we have enough pelts, but things aren't looking so hot. If I get attacked again, I might die. And there's a wolf over here. I'm going to try to go up here and go around them. The wolves are insane. I just want to make it home. But we've shot all sorts of stuff. Um, a deer, I think three wolves now. It's kind of Whoa. crazy. Oh no. So that's, that's bad. She sprained her wrist going up this hill. And you can't hold your gun. when you have a sprained wrist. So now I don't I can't even shoot. We have to fight if the wolf comes. Wind is blowing too 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 much to make a fire if we have to. Yeah, she she really sucks at hills. So this is as far as I can go this way. I'm gonna try to make it to the house. Am I losing health? Our health is super low. This could be it, man. Yeah, clown girl, yeah. This could be this could be the last day. Easily.
Um, well, I'm trying to get back to the house that you've seen. But I had to go a different way because of the wolf. I don't actually know technically where I am. Technically. Some, some call that getting lost. Yeah, the cabin with the fireplace. Is this the lake? What is this? That's not a lake. Yeah, I think the lake is this way, but I don't see it. Oh god. That is a lake, that is a lake. Isn't it? Yes! That's the lake, okay. Now we just need to get home. So we just need to get down off this mountain, I think. There's a the railroad. Oh my god. Oh my god, we did it. Oh my god. Woo! Look at all the meat we have. Holy crap! Oh my god, oh my god. <sighs> Alright. We're going to rest up before we go out again. So, here's all of our stuff. We've got two, three deer hides. Uh, one, two, three, four. I think this is our fourth wolf pelt, so we can actually make, we can make a jacket once they cure. Yeah, they just have to sit and, and um, dry out. Because, you know, they, they were just being worn. But we have, um, we have four now. Uh, we can make either deer pants or deer boots. I think, yeah, we can make both. Uh, I mean, not both at the same time, but either, I mean to say. Um, and we have two rabbit skins. If we get two more, we can make a mitt. Uh, mittens. Deer pants, deer boots. Oh, gosh. Gosh, gosh, gosh. Do we have food in here? I think we have some food. Um, all right, so I'm going to eat. OK, I'm going to drink. Um, now I'm going to take all the rest of this raw meat <clears throat> and I'm going to leave it in the snow. Make a new pile. Okay. So we're we're safe-ish. And as long as we go to sleep. I'm gonna need to rest soon. Yeah, we should be fine. Woo! <clears throat> So I want to make all these clothes. The problem is they have to. All these things have to dry, and uh, and they're not dry. So let's see. We should probably make more bandages. If 
you set them outside, they'd get wet from the snow. Um, but you have to, you just set them inside. And then they, um, they dry out eventually. Alright, so we'll make... We'll make more bandages so that I'll probably forget. It's just while I'm thinking about it. And then we'll go to bed. And hopefully we'll heal most most of the way. Oh, that was so scary. Um, so, so okay, we went to find this tower that I saw. It's like a lookout tower. And um, and a wolf attacked us, and I missed with the rifle. And so I attacked him with my knife. And I got him. I slashed him, but he ran away, bleeding. And we followed the blood and picked up his... Uh, carcass. And I thought I was pretty cool. Then we found another wolf. And that wolf kicked our ass. Um, and that left us with, I don't know, it was like 38% health. But everything's okay. Yeah, it's the same clown from yesterday. It's it's the same. We haven't died, if that's what you mean. It's the same game. I'm going to be so sad when we do die, though. Still, still nighttime, and we haven't. Uh, I mean, we fully rested. We're playing this in a cold room. Yeah, it was pretty cold here earlier, actually. But I closed the window, and it's warmed up a bit. Sit your feet in ice. That sounds. Oh, it's dawn. Oh, yeah. Look how cold it is. Another night. Um, it's, it's negative, it feels like negative 28 with the wind chill. It's, it's actually really pretty though. Spend a little bit of time. Hopefully, it'll warm up a bit. Maybe it's time to maybe tear down the curtains. clothes. Um, after two wolf attacks, we may have lost some clothing. I didn't even think to look. Actually, I don't think we lost anything. And it's all in pretty good condition, actually. We could maybe repair the toque. That actually would give us an extra degree of warmth.
Let's do that. Wonderful. Repair. I, I generally like to repair the stuff where um, I won't waste material because it won't quite get to 100%. Yeah, sadly you have to repair animal clothes. And what's worse is you don't repair them with cloth. You actually repair them with more animal skin. So you have to keep you have to keep killing. You have to become a killing machine. Technically you don't need to kill, right? You could just find dead animals. But usually usually when there's dead animals, the wolves are eating them. Is that all of our cooked meat? We've got one piece left. So. So what should we do? Um, our health isn't quite 100%. Um, we could spend today cooking and then try going out again tomorrow. And that way we'll be at 100%. Could also finish reading that book. Maybe if there isn't anything to do outside. Um, let's see how the weather is. Pretty chilly. Pretty cold, actually. Not even just chilly. Just damn cold. Looks like it's warming up. Oh look, it's another deer. I think we have enough meat for the time being. Let's do some more cooking. Let's, let's cook a whole, whole mess. We'll leave all the fresh stuff out here. So, uh, see that tower in the distance? That's where we tried to go. It's, it's uh, eluded us for now. skins are done. We just need two more. What's at the tower? I mean, it's the same everywhere. There's, there's no way of knowing until you I'm go there. Fire. Um, if you just mean like in terms of a point of interest, there's, there's like a, it's like a little lookout station. So there's a little, there's a staircase up to a balcony and then you can see, you can see everything. Um, 
Yeah, things are randomly placed, yeah. Every, all the items are random. Um, but it, there's like beds up there, and I think there's a stove. Same buildings, random items, yep. Yep, usually you'll find stuff that makes sense. You know, like if you search cabins, you'll find clothes. And if you search um, lockers, you know, you'll find whatever belongs in lockers, stuff like that. If you search um, filing cabinets, you'll find candy bars and, uh, I don't know, junk. Boy, I didn't think that we picked up that much meat. Oh, we had meat on us? No. Yeah, how do we pick up this much meat? How much meat do we have? That's, that's a fair good bit. But she eats like a horse. Nuts and stuff with liquid. Um, yeah, I can't. What else do you find in filing cabinets? I can't even remember. Like scraps of cloth or something. I don't know. It's it. There's not a whole lot of items, but like generally speaking, you won't find a crowbar in a filing cabinet, but you will find a crowbar in like the bathroom of a gas station or something. Uh. Beans. You can find some beans. Let's 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 just cook some more. We'll make some more water. We actually didn't make a whole lot last time we made water. Oh, but we'll be totally healed up tomorrow. I, I want to try one more time to go back to the dam. Nature hot dogs? Uh, no, but... So this thing I'm talking about, I want to go back to the dam, but I want to do it on the, the pond, like the, the, the lake. There's like a river or something that comes off the lake, and there's a bunch of cattails there. So I want to, I want to do that. The problem is... Every, we've tried twice, and both times there were two wolves guarding, um, which is just too many wolves. Too much wolf. Wolves, hot dogs. Well, we've made hot dogs out of the wolves. The wolves came pretty close to making hot dogs out of us, so it's a give and a take. So uh, early in the stream, we went to a new cabin, and we found something that repaired our gun. You got a new calculator today that fits your wallet super thin. I think I've seen stuff like that. That's pretty cool. Um, it's just like a little credit card-shaped calculator. That's pretty cool. It's crazy how small stuff is. Um, 
All right, it's it's pretty much nighttime. We got uh, another gallon or so of water. Let's drop. some of this meat away. Oh, the container's full. Okay, so that's one of the problems with this uh, this place is that there's just not a whole lot of storage space. You wish you had it for a school test? Do they still not let... Good God! Hey, how about we go adventure out in this? Let's go look for that tower. <clears throat> what do you think? I can't even see five feet. Yeah, it's crazy. <clears throat> um, it's really cold, too. Well, I was hoping I could do a little light reading, but... Um... I guess we should head to bed. Let's see. The problem is we're not very tired. And so... Wait, where are we? I'm, I'm all turned around now. There we go. Um, see if the weather improves. Oops. We're not very tired because we didn't really do much stuff today. We just sat around and cooked. Yeah. What is that? 12 days, 8 hours. That's not bad. That's not bad in Stalker. Well, essentially Stalker. Sounds like it's calmed down. And we're fully rested. So if I can find my way back out, maybe maybe it's light enough outside we can do some reading. Can I tear down a curtain? Huh. I thought it might be too dark. Okay, I am not quite sure where the door is. Oh! Jesus, it's dark. Usually it stays pretty light outside. It must be a full moon. Or a not full moon. A new moon, I think. Is, I think is what it's called. Um, how cold is this? Not very cold. Let's tr let's see if it'll let me read. Ah, it's light enough to read. Oh shit! Did you see that? The blizzard started, and I just lost that hour of reading because it got too cold. Jesus Christ! That's why you never tell it to do like three hours worth of stuff. Because then you'll wake up dead. Still haven't found a second pair of socks. Jesus. I, I, it's, it's too dark to do anything. How do you... How do you wake up dead? I mean, you know, just one morning, you wake up, find yourself dead. 
it's just uh, it's just a shame, really. Is there anything I can do that is productive? Honestly, let's see if we can repair in this light. Too dark. Too dark to repair. A bandage was that too was that too dark? Apparently she's good at tearing things in the dark. Oh come on, it was so it was so warm out earlier. Alright, well. Yeah, it's so dark outside and it's so dark inside that I don't even know what I'm looking at. I think I think we're on the top floor. Now, some people like to carry around the lantern, but uh, I don't want to waste fuel because I'm too cheap. There we go. All right. Just like carcasses lying all around. So let's put the cloth back. Probably grab a couple more matches. All right, let's let's take another crack at it. Let's see if. Uh, See if the wolves are going to destroy us today. See how cold it is first. It's snowing and it's pretty cold. Oh, there's another deer. It's like coming right to the house. It's like delivery. Food time? All right. Yeah, I'm getting pretty hungry myself. All right, let's spend a little time reading. Seems to be snowing less, but it's still cold. How cold? Feels like 17 degrees.
All right. Just about noon. Check the temperature again. Ooh. So it's warmer, but the visibility is reduced. All right. So I'm thinking this is a little bit tangential, but I'm I'm thinking what really made that last trip scary was we didn't have enough painkillers to to fix our hand that second time. So I'm just going to grab some more. It's kind of kind of a unrelated thing, but you know, obviously it's pretty related. All right, we've got uh, one, two, and the third one is in here, right? So this this deer hide is just about cured. Um, we've got two cured wolf pelts. Can't do anything till we get four. That's going to be a while. But we could make the, the deer skin something. So <clears throat> we were looking at the weight earlier because that's always a big thing. So if we go from I think 1.1 to 4.4 or 2.2 to 4.4 and the boots are actually warmer I want to say. <clears throat> Yeah, so I feel like I really want to make the boots. The problem is I don't know how many degrees of warmth those work boots have back in the dam because we never got a chance to repair them. Um, so it's kind of a gamble, you know, we might have to find another piece of deer skin before we can make uh, anything that's useful if, if we get the boots and then go to the dam and then we have the other boots. Yeah, so we go to 1.4 to 3.6. Oh, 1.6 to something crazy. Four point five. It's like three degrees. I mean, three degrees doesn't sound like a lot, but basically you've got to keep yourself above freezing at thirty-two, and every every little degree helps for sure. <clears throat> um, Let's, let's not make any of those just yet. All right, so instead, I'm just going to take another crack, going back to the dam. Got to get rid of this meat, grab something like a soda. Uh, 
Um, Not a whole lot of water. That's probably too much, but the thing about water is it's you can get it anywhere. So if you need to drop some, you could drop some. And you drink it as you go. So the weight just kind of disappears slowly. Let's I don't I don't know if this is super useful. Um, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do something different than what I was gonna say. I was gonna say let's sharpen our weapons, our tools. I'm just gonna switch to these better ones, and then we'll sharpen at some point if, if we need to. Um, having the sharpening stones gives us options, though. Since we're going to the dam to pick stuff up. Uh, oops, I'm going. To, I'm not going to need this. This is it's a point two pounds. It's not really very significant, <clears throat> but um, every little bit. I don't think we're going to need the stem. I feel like the stem is better for long distance journeys. I, I was, I've was, i used the stem a couple of times to save myself. When your health gets really low and you're like so tired, your health drains, um, eventually she gets woozy and it's actually really nauseating to try to play. And it, she, she keeps getting woozier and keeps getting woozier until just like the screen is just swimming and then she dies. And that's a good time to, I think, to use the stem. Let's hope, let's hope we don't get that just trying to go to the dam. All right, that's about as good as I can do. So <clears throat> if it weren't for the gun, we'd be in better shape. Gun is heavy. Perfect temperature. Terrible visibility. Let's give it another shot, baby. These these wolves move. Uh, all the animals move around, and they shouldn't be in the same place every day. But you never know. Use our eagle eye vision here. Looking for movement. Looking for little bits of wolf hair on the ground. Uh, the scent of wolf breath in the air. Anything that'll clue you in. I don't see anything. Could be behind this rock. I'm thinking again about we could kill that wolf. I mean that bear, but don't think I'm going to. That's that's for when I feel a little bit more comfortable and want something exciting to do. But I'm, I'm not there yet. Got it, dear. 
All right. Success. So we're not out of the woods, so to speak. This is the little river. Um, I don't exactly know the path, but it is a river, so should be able to follow it. Now, we can start looking for cattails again. Dude. Um, I believe that there are cattails somewhere. I don't see it. Deers scare me. Let's pick up a couple sticks. Oh, there's, there's some. So all that meat we have is great, but it smells. So it attracts animals. Um, it also perishes. And eventually will Go rot, but not the beautiful cat tip. Perfect emergency food, perfect anytime. Tastes good, good for you. Dices it slices. Kind of sounds like Rimworld music right there. Usually the game puts rocks around where there's rabbits. Ha <laughs> ha! Um, let's go for it. Where there's rabbits. Uh, on the one hand, maybe there aren't any wolves because. Yeah. Stop. Because the wolves would have eaten the rabbits. On the other hand, maybe there are wolves because wolves want to eat rabbits. Not really sure how it goes. Uh, picking up these sticks mostly to have a fire in case we need it. Oh, come on, you. That was dead on. Something's dead over here. That's rabbit number three. I think we need four. Oh, it smells. Oops, that's not what I want. What the? What? No, pick it up. Let's get rabbit number four. Make those mittens. Kitten mittens. Oh. That was, uh, was a little much. What's this? What's this girl's name anyway? She's so mad, she's just throwing at the ground. Stop that. Stop that, Beatrice. Uh, 
Uh, looks like we're kind of early afternoon. Ooh, that was terrible. Luckily, they're not very smart. Oh, you, you rascal. You saw me throw. I feel like he's getting smart to me. He's moving just as I uh, release. So this is not where I want to go, I think. That takes you somewhere. Stop. But I want to go here, I think. But I really want the rabbit. Well, I don't think it's uh, it's in the in the fate books today. What use is three rabbits? I don't know. You can boil them. You can mash them. You can cook them in a stew. Uh, Felt like a nice little safe area, but uh, I don't feel too safe over here. It's a dead deer and a little hunting blind and a wolf. So I'm crouching. Don't know if that actually helps. He's going to see me, isn't he? I feel like crashing helps. Oh. I, I really want you to keep going, Mr. Wolf. sound you hear it echo how fantastic is that well I thought it was coming closer to me should I shouldn't I I'm doing it can't, can't let good meat go to waste. So, just as long as there's not another one. What we're going to do is check out this blind uh, and then make a fire next to the deer, get the deer's pelt. Or I guess you don't say pelt for deer, right? You call it skin. I, guess. I don't know. Hide. Um, to warm up the deer, 
we can cook some of the meat. Get and get its hide. That's really want the deer hide. Um, now it's pretty heavy, so I think we're gonna have to turn around. And uh, head home. Who, who knows what's in here? Usually hunting supplies. Oh, it's a pry bar. That's useful. A bullet. An arrow. Okay, so far so good. Nice. Condensed milk. And another MRE. Wow, that's good luck. Um, sometimes there's stuff hiding on here. Uh, I've seen hand axes like stuck in the wall. It's kind of peaceful if, if, if only we, I mean, um, except for the fact that we just had to kill a wolf. Well, had to, I guess is arguable. But, uh, I would say he's coming right for me. All right, let's grab um, let's grab one of these big guys. Perfect. And uh, it's gonna be dark. Man, I'm not sure I can carry much more. When we head home, and that's not good. Oh, we didn't bring a book. That's not good either. That's not good. It's these little forgetful things that'll kill you. And we run out of matches because we can't start a fire. It's a good thing it's not a blizzard. Wood. It's actually probably too much wood, but I'd rather not carry the wood, so. Um. Still a little bit frozen. I, I think it just goes faster once it's unfrozen. And if it's too too um, too frozen, you can't do it with your hands. I know that much. Oh, it's dark. It's nighttime. God, it's dark. Uh, 
Um, okay, so I, I thought we'd be able to see by the light of the moon. Um, but I, we can't see shit. Well, I, I guess I might as well get the gut. Oh, Jesus. We're going to be pretty sleepy. Oh, don't let the fire go out. Don't let the fire go out. I, I didn't really think to look. Um, I, I don't have a sleeping bag, so I can't sleep. I could make a lean-to thing. If I had, like, something. 15 sticks and 5 cloth. Okay, we're not gonna, not gonna scrounge that up anytime soon. Hey, Joey. What's up, man? We've, um, we found ourselves in a little bit of a predicament. A little bit of a perdinky dink. I don't rest in my faith. Well, this deer was dead when we got here. The problem is, it, it's nighttime and I can't see anything. Um, so I'm hoping that I can find some more wood and not get killed in the dark in order to make it to morning. Oh my god. Okay, perfect. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I'm going to tab out to you not in this situation because fuck far. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, I'm pretty horrified myself. I'm back at the campfire at least. Um... <laughs> If it's any consolation, there's no zombies. Pretty much the only thing that's going to attack me is a uh, is a wolf. Um, don't really need too much water. Yeah, we've killed a lot of stuff today. We've become a death machine. Uh, although, to be fair, we almost died as well. So, we're going to be super overweight coming back in. Um, I'm not going to drop any of this precious meat. What is skins? I'll, I'll probably drop the wood that I haven't used. But... Yeah, all of this is pretty much useful. So, just gonna hang out. Uh, chill by the fire. So, did you ever hear the one about the the man with the hook for a hand? <laughs> uh, 
Is there, is there anything I can do with my time that is somewhat useful? The Hash Slinging Slasher. Uh, the one that I like so much was the calls coming from in the in the building. I I might as well go ahead and cook this. I mean, it doesn't last as long cooked, but I, I think we'll eat it by the time it uh, degrades. And what else should we do? We can't sleep. Might as well use it. Oh. Might as well use the time a little bit. So here's the kind of thing where we're up. This is based on the decisions that we've made. Um, we're really up to the game to decide how this is going to play out. Because if we get a blizzard and the fire goes out, um, I wouldn't even know which direction to go. I think the cave was that way. I think... Oh, I can start to see stuff now. So the cave is over there. Okay, so I, it's actually getting lighter. Um, I can head to the cave to get away from the wind. Um, how long till day? I'm not sure. But this is the little meter up at the top right. So we're late night. It'll be dawn and probably... I don't know two or three hours or something. Um, but yeah, I can head to the cave to block the wind. But then, you know, we need to go home. Make a cave base be a cave dweller. It's pretty hard to live outside in this game, even in a cave. It, it gets really cold. Um, but people do challenges where they're not allowed to go inside. And people are good enough that they can survive for a while. But I'm not that good. What else should we... What else should we drop? Maybe I'll drop some of the water. Now we've really got to get back to the dam, because we've got a pry bar. People need to stop trying so hard. Actually, it's pretty. There's some pretty cool people who play who play this game. Uh, people, some some. Let's let's say let's players because I don't think they stream. They just do YouTube videos. People who I've watched for a while. And it's so f interesting to see how the different games go. Um, All right, let's eat all we can. That reduces your weight. Okay, we've got two hours of campfire left. And uh, if we need to, a piece of firewood. So I think we're going to make it to morning. The question is, what's the weather going to be like in the morning? Uh, what else can we drop? Can we read by the fire? Oh, too tired. Fair enough. Um, yeah, but, uh, there's a guy who streams this game now. He, it, I've, oh, I've only seen him stream two different games. One is uh, this, and the other is um, Harvest Moon. Oh, what is the new one called? The one that was so popular? Um, 
and he's like watching Bob Ross. He's, he's awesome. He's super chill. He doesn't scream when wolves run at him. <laughs> like other streamers. Um, he's, he's pretty cool. It's like uh, Ozark or something. Hold on, let me see. Who is his name? Oh, it's not telling me. Ran Randark. The Wiz Arc. That's that's where it is. The Wiz Arc. Um. And he's he's just so calm. It's so pleasant to watch. Uh, it's not it's not the it's not what I'm going for, by the way. Uh, although it, it it is how I tried to play Cuphead. That was the first game I streamed. And. Tried to play it chill. Um, I don't think we need more water to carry back. We're, we're pretty heavy. So I'm at the point where all I can think to do is just go ahead and, and wait. So we've got two hours on the fire. I'm going to hit past time for one hour. Oh, I got an achievement. Survive an entire now at night outside. Sun's coming up. It's still pretty dark though. So let's um Let's do it again. What day is this? It's pretty far. We've gotten pretty far. Um, it'll say when the when dawn happens, it'll tell us how, how long we've gone. Look how pretty it is. Um, all right, let's eat and drink. And then run like hell. Alright, um, good luck, dear. Have a good day, dear. Thank you. Thank you for your hopsitality. I guess that would be better for a rabbit, but deer do hop, so I'm gonna stick, I'm gonna stick with it. This is the wolf we just killed. Uh, your recent step way past the point I should have found the birds start waking up in my area around four to four. It's it's true, yeah. When I lived in Illinois, the annoying Oh my god, the birds were so annoying at four in the morning. And it would always be like four is that time where you finally get to bed and you think, Alright, at least I'm gonna get a couple hours. And then the birds start. And it's like, why? Just leave me alone. I'm trying to sleep. And all they want to do is have sex. You know? The birds are like, hey, look at me. I'm a potential mate. Usually you're asleep at two. I mean, that's good. That's good. It's good for you, Joey. Yeah, I, I like going to sleep at two, for sure. But sometimes I just can't go to sleep. It's like too, I'm too stressed out or too, I don't know, just too awake. Well, we got a couple of cattails. Oh shit, it's really cold. I didn't think, I didn't think to look about that. I can't run. Okay, panic situation. This is the panic situation. 
it's so cold. How cold is it? It's so cold that when she sits around the house, she really sits around the house. I fucked up. Yeah, I mean, it's not good. It's not good. What we don't want to see is like anything else get in the way. We really want to get home at this point. But we're not far. So as long as there's no wolves. Or like a like a sprained ankle. That would be bad. Okay, we're gonna have two stats in the red, which is um Yeah, this is ice. There's actually ice in the game that has a chance of breaking. You fall you fall through. That's not good for you. Um, two stats in the red means our health is going to be dropping pretty significantly. You can already see it's dropping, but it's really slow because she's just tired. But wait till she's tired and freezing. But you can see the you can see the cabin. Uh, it looks like it's warming up, actually. It's only two arrows cold. I think I think we're fine. Um. So essentially, all we need to do is go to bed. Because that'll warm us up and make us not tired. Very nice. Very nice. Let's hop in here. Let's just do like three hours to kind of get us going. One of my friends fell through ice before in winter when a group of us were walking home, but I already had departed to go to my house because it was close at that point. Got to be careful. It was like four years ago. And that's... I can only imagine how terrifying that would be. Uh, in fact, I'd prefer not to imagine how terrifying that would be, because that sounds pretty horrible. Alright, we got a little bit of sleep in us, no longer in the red. I think let's try to find some stuff to do, because it's, it's noon, so I don't want to go to sleep now, we'll wake up at night. The creek was the quickest path before there was less snow on it. I feel like anytime someone says, hey, let's take the shortcut through the frozen creek, that's not a good it's not a good idea. Uh, where where can we put this meat? We have too much meat. It was below zero. I I don't know. I, I didn't grow up in a place where there was like frozen water. Actually, um, so where I grew up had some brackish water, which is like where salt water and fresh water mix. And so it because of the salt, it usually doesn't freeze, but this one winter, it got cold enough that it froze. And um, it was kind of crazy, because it's a big body of water. Um, I don't know what to do with this meat or this stuff. We, we really don't have any more storage down here. So I could just put it on the ground. I don't know if it degrades faster on the ground. So I think some stuff does. 
Well, So I want to put all the sort of non-perishables in the cabinet because those are those are the things we're going to keep around. Historical people have used frozen bodies. I thought that's the end of your comment, but frozen bodies of water as shortcuts are ways to travel to islands. Uh, yeah, and then it unfreezes and then it can't get back. Let's drop all of our new pelts. Uh, drop a drop a, and drop a drop a. So. Can you get a heater? No. I mean, you can start a fire in the, in the, um, you know, fireplace thing. Um, I want to say some buildings actually have fireplace fireplaces, but I, it all works pretty much the same. Um, let's put the pelt next to the other pelts. All right, where do we put an arrow? Maybe tools? And the crowbar we don't need until we go back to the dam. Okay, some medical stuff to put up. This is, I, I really wish this part of the game didn't take so long, and it doesn't have to. But you know, I like to be organized. I guess I don't. I don't know. All right, that's pretty much it. We got some feathers here. Uh, old man's beard. Uh, we're still pretty heavy, mostly because of the the meat. Let's put up these cattails. I don't think we're gonna eat them before we eat this meat. And that looks pretty good. Take a little bottle of water. Uh, no, 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 no. I mean, like this potbelly stove. So you could, you could, you know, put a, build a fire in the potbelly stove. You actually can't build a f campfire. Cannot start campfire indoors. For obvious reasons. All right. So we've dumped all of our ill-gained goods. What do we want to do today? Um, we could start on... We could start on uh, our garment. We have three deer hides. I don't think we have um, these aren't cured, but yeah, we could start on the deer a deer garment. Let's make let's make deer boots. Let's make deer pants. Deer pants. I write to you to tell you of a great discovery. Um, all right, how do you make deer pants? We need sewing kit or fishing tackle. We need four cured gut. One, two, Three, four. Um, 
And I think a sewing kit makes you go faster. So let's, let's grab a couple sewing kits here. And let's see how this goes. These usually take a lot of time. So it's going to take 12.5 hours. So let's do like two hours, see how that goes. You might have to take a little nap. All right. Let's eat some more stuff. It's an episode of Peppa Pig, Ben in Australia. So speaking of Peppa Pig, which I've never seen, by the way, but Peppa Pig has been banned in China because apparently some gangs have taken Peppa Pig as their, like, symbol. Um, but Joey said, uh, message of the episode was that spiders were not harmful, which obviously is not a good message for children in Australia. Yeah, I guess in Australia everything is, uh, is much worse. Although, I mean, I was bitten by a spider when I was really young, like five, and I am terrified of spiders now. And it didn't kill me, but they're not friendly. You know, they're not cool. Spiders are not cool, Joey. <clears throat> That's a fact. All right, it's too dark to craft. Let's head outside, see how bright it is. It doesn't seem to be very bright. But nonetheless, I'm going to try to read. It's let me read. I need to find a place to rest. I think we can get another hour. So we're one hour away from reading that book. Time for Betty Bye. Uh, fun fact about Chinese censorship. Winnie the Pooh was also banned. Because people kept comparing him to the current and indefinitely long president. Pooh's not long. He's round. Pooh's very round, Joe. He's not long. And long is the Secretary of State. <laughs> Sorry. Uh... Let's top up. I think we can make it to morning. I really like the Winnie the Pooh movie, I guess it was, the Disney movie where he gets stuck because he ate too much honey. Picture of Winnie the Pooh in a king's outfit, which got instant banned. I think, you know, the shitty thing about censorship is it works a lot. All right, let's see if we can finish these pants. Eight hours. Um, to make a pair of pants is a, is a great thing. Because um, people will think we're super stylish. We'll 
will make all the rage at the parties. Alright, this should do it. If it's... We have some pants! Aren't they beautiful? Warm and stylish. I feel like the tassels are a bit much. Like, we didn't really need the tassels, did we? But, you know. You gotta be stylish. Alright, and it's only an hour left in the book. We don't we don't need to read this outside because it's daylight. But I'm doing it. Alright, that gives us field dressing experience. Where did I hear Peppa Pig? Peppa Pig fact? Uh, I think from Delvina. I think Delvina told me. Um, all right, well, we've got, we've got pants. I don't, we don't, I think we're one deer hide short and we're one rabbit pelt short of making stuff. But, uh, once, once the wolf hides dry, we can make the wolf jacket. Well, that was, that was kind of crazy. We died, we almost died a couple of times, went through some scary stuff. Um, all this deer meat is making me really hungry. So I'm going to go eat dinner. But I'm super excited about where we are, where we're going. I think we're going to make this place our own. We'll put a little throw rug. Uh, we'll put some paintings on the wall. I think we'll give it a new coat of paint. It's going to be beautiful. So thanks for tuning in. And uh, have a nice night, everybody. Uh, talk to you tomorrow, Joey, or whenever. See ya.